Hi there, and welcome back. As I mentioned a couple of times in the past videos, uh, now that you learned a whole bunch of stuff, it would be very useful for you to open up your compiler, whatever you're compiling on, whichever program, uh, compiler program you're using, and whatever operating system you're on, whether it's Windows or Mac or Linux or whatever you may be using, and start practicing a whole bunch of random stuff that uh, you could think up with all the uh, stuff we've learned to do, all these uh, powerful commands we've learned so far. And this will definitely help you remember all of this functionality so that when it comes to handy later on, and boy it will, um, you will definitely remember how everything works. And if you're a little like out of ideas or something, so I'm trying to put together some sort of forum where I will be able to post um, projects and uh, basically programs which uh, you viewers can try to make for practice. Currently I'm trying one free forum website which is hosted by freeboards.net uh, and uh, the website to go here is as you see forum.freeboards.net question mark m forum equals anti-rtfm just look at the video comments to sorry the uh, video information on the right side to uh, see the exact uh, website and you can uh, register and log in and start viewing the different projects that I've already posted you know I've posted two different projects and you can start posting your uh, results because um, when you're done you pretty much will post your uh, results as a reply to the forum and then I could look over your code and correct if you've done any, any mistakes or uh, tell you that you did a good job and eventually uh, hopefully this forum will get a little bigger maybe we'll open up some more uh, categories in this forum to discuss different other stuff uh, unfortunately I've noticed uh, a little bit of lag with this uh, forum website um, they say that nothing in the world is for free so I'd expect that if there's lag on this website and it's going very slow it's probably because it's uh, <laughs> a free forum website um, so they're probably like hosting this website for thousands of people who are all like grabbing onto the same uh, server at the same time so it's taking a lot of lag uh, if this turns out to be the case uh, which I'm asking for a poll over here in the general compar uh, a category if the if for you the form is performing well not like them by me so then we might need to move over to some other form website or, or try out something else um, if you haven't read the uh, video info on my other videos so far um, I mentioned that if you have a uh, suggestion about how to make the videos a little more clearer and uh, more noob helpful and explanatory please send me a message by way of uh, YouTube messaging um, if you have any C++ questions like if you have a question on something I said in the video so please comment uh, don't send a message uh, which will give me a lot of uh, like too many messages in my inbox so please just comment and I will try to brush through all the comments on all videos and uh, find your answer. So again, if it's about the video itself, send me a message. Uh, if you maybe found a mistake or or if you think something's wrong or if you think that something could be explained a little bit better, etc., etc., send me a message. Uh, if it's a question about C++, just comment on that video. Uh, all these videos are obviously a first stab at this uh, attempt to make a very nice explanatory series of uh, video tutorials for absolute newbies uh, hopefully this will uh, all get better and better with uh, all of your help uh, your comments responses and uh, feedback and uh, this will all help make future videos and revisions and updates better er, as you see in the uh, you can see already uh, videos uh, four five six and seven were already updated once so yeah with your help um, we can all together revise these videos and make them as best as possible 
Like for example, I remember when I was figuring out C++, uh, not from video tutorials like these, but uh, straight out of the books, I uh, sometimes a few a few lines, a few phrases were like very hard to understand. Uh, then after I figured it out, I told myself, if this guy would only write it like this and like that, and not as cryptic uh, as he did write it in the book, I would have figured it out in two minutes, if he would just explain it in another different set of words. So that's what I'm looking for, if you guys can feedback how, uh, if you had such thoughts on any of the videos, that if you would only say it a little bit more different and a little more clearer, it would be easier to understand. And yeah, so enough about that. Get to work on your compilers. Uh, start making a whole bunch of crap with your compilers. Uh, I'll repeat, if uh, you're on Microsoft Windows, I would highly suggest that you go to the Microsoft uh, Visual Studio Express uh, website and download the, the Microsoft Visual Studio Express uh, compiler. Um, if you're on another operating system, uh, please use Google. That's www.google.com and search for something like a uh, free compiler for whatever your operating system is, uh, Mac or Linux, etc. If you like my videos and they're helping you learn uh, C++, and you know someone else, a friend of yours maybe, who also wanted to learn C++ but didn't know how to go about it, please refer her or him to my video tutorials and try to spread the words the, the word uh try to please try to rate my videos uh put some comments and hopefully we'll get to draw attention of a little bit of a crowd of those who are uh, as desperate as i used to be about learning c++ uh, about the comments and the questions on c++ please do not be shy or ashamed for any reason to ask any question I will try to be as uh, noob patient as possible. So basically I will try to have unlimited patience for any of the most stupidest uh, newbie questions you can ever ask. So if you didn't get, get something right on the first time, please ask again and again and again. And I will try as much as possible to answer any of your questions. Thank you very much for watching.